Also guys, welcome back to another episode of the Gran Turismo 2 A-Spec mod. In the last episode, we managed to successfully complete all of the special events. Um, so if we go on, go race real quick. Right, so as you can see, uh, all these events now complete. So, which means we can fully concentrate on com completing the Gran Turismo League. Um, which includes all the national events, um, the European and Pacific League, and then also the Grand Turismo World League, of course. So, <clears throat> if we go back, this episode we're going to concentrate on the French nationals. Now, there's only two events for this one, um, which you, you'd think would be, a, you know, would, would make a quick video, but um, in actuality. If you if you go on uh, if you go on these events, um, I think I think this one in particular will have to find a new car and tune it up. Um, I mean, I did test this <laughs> off screen. I did actually test this uh, with the Ford GT40 just to check if um, that it was allowed, and it was it was in fact allowed. But just just for I don't know. Making yeah, I don't know. Just just for realism, I want to actually find a fr uh, like, you know, tune up a French car rather than just um, le like going going into this event with, you know, any any old car uh, within that uh, restriction. So that's what we're going to do this episode. So, in fact, a lot of these um, the restrictions have actually uh, been modified. So with this one. I believe I don't I don't believe this was uh, uh, these were all the same before uh, especially especially the the third race I believe that was an international sea event but same with the French nationals uh, this episode but anyway so yeah this one's completely different um, 690 horsepower that's a that's a lot like, that's a big uh, restriction anyway um, for the first event Tahiti Road we have just the vehicle for that and it was one that we acquired very recently. Uh, in fact, I might actually sell these two, but... Yeah, the 806, Peugeot 806. Uh, so this was an old touring car? Um, I didn't even know this existed. A pro car, but... Yeah, this has 296 horsepower. I, I don't believe you can tune it up, but we'll find out... I, I, I'm sure I tested it out. I don't think you can actually tune this up, but yeah. So we'll lead with this car in, in, in the first race. So Tahiti Road, 345 horsepower restriction, 4,000 credits. See, these are low. These are low amounts of uh, like credits that, that that have been paid out. So you'd think this would be quite, you know, quite easy. Um, but I feel like some of these are going to be challenging because it means. It means buying cars each episode and tuning them up, but anyway, without further ado, for this one, it's Tahiti Road. Actually, they're both Tahiti Road. <laughs> I don't know why I just realised. But um, yeah, let's uh, give it a go. Alright, race one. Here we go. <laughs> okay, we've got quite a, a decent mix of cars here. None are racing modified like mine. Um, so I feel like this will be quite easy. Yeah. Although this this car is so big, I can't see. <laughs> I can't see the corners. So. Oh, this this Ventura behind me is actually keeping up with me. Well, it was. Also got the 306, which seems to be a popular popular car in this A spec mod. It was a uh, it was a popular opponent in the NA Tune Car Club. Yeah, that 306 was a popular car in the NA Car Cup. Um, oh god. Okay, this has no top speed. But acceleration is decent though. Yeah, this guy, this car, this car is really quick. I think this has the exact same amount of power as my car as well. Oh, please turn, thank god. There's three laps of this, okay. 
that's definitely changed as well. I'm glad that, um... Oh god! Wow. Okay, I thought he was going to sideswipe me. Um, I'm glad the m moderators for the Ace mod, or the developers of the... Uh, you know, switched up the national events a little bit. Add more challenging cars, because it makes it, it... I don't know, it makes it a lot more challenging than a lot. Uh, makes for better racing. Okay, the re okay, the sports spider's catching up. Oh. Okay, the ratios need changing or something. Okay, yeah. It seems very close so far. But this 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 seems uh, very doable though. Okay, last lap, come on. Let's see what I can do here. Ugh, the the turning's not that great. <laughs> you know. It's n it doesn't feel like a proper race car. <laughs> I mean, th this is kind of a gimmick car, but... Perfect for this event. But the acceleration for the, the, the power that it has is really good. Oh god. I'm on my tail. of corners to go. Oh yeah, we've got this now. Yay! Alright. That's more challenging than I thought. I think a lot of these are going to be <laughs> more challenging than, than I think. But, um, yeah. That was race one out of two of the French Nationals. Um, Decent opponents there, especially the Venturi and the Sports Spider. Yeah. That was a success. Nice 4,000 credits in the bank. <laughs> we do have a million, but every little helps. And we got a new car acquired, so let's see what it is. Alright, so that was race one of Tahiti Road. So let's go back to the garage. See what we've won. Uh, what is this? I'm gonna. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, it's. This is a. De this is definitely an A spec car because I've never seen this in my life. Um, Renault Alpine A four four two B. Um. So, I think we should use this for the next event. <laughs> um. In fact, let's get in this. Uh, it seems like a race car from 1975. I'm guessing this is a Le Mans car? Uh, it looks like it. Um, wow, this is really cool. Um, yeah, we're definitely using this. Alright, so that's uh, that's our car sorted for the next event, uh, luckily. Um, so I was going to actually purchase a... Uh, this, okay, so guys, I'll tell you what I was going to do. So... Because I'm, because I was thinking, okay, this is going to be really tough, the next event. Um, what I was thinking of doing is uh, going to West City and basically buying uh, one of these, a Venturi Atlantic 400, right? And I was basically going to tune the tune the living fuck out of this car. Uh, is what I was going to do. Um, and I was, I was like, you know what, that's going to be enough. But since we got this car. Unlocked, we, we don't need to. Um, yeah, that's really cool. Um, I'm hoping it, it drives really well. It doesn't drive like a pig, but it, it shouldn't. But Anyway. Race 2 of Tahiti Road. I'm assuming they're, they're all going to be race cars. So, I, what I'm predicting is the um, Venturi Atlantic LM Edition, or whatever it's called. The uh, race racing mod, or racing version of that car. I think the I, I I might maybe even the 806 again, 
because there's not many French uh, race cars in this. Um, what else? Maybe, uh, maybe like a rally car because there's no other, there's no real other opponents that I can think of, unless it's just like standard cars and they're just highly tuned. But I don't know. Oh, I guess we'll find out in a second, guys. Um, but yeah, let's go. Alright, oh, there we go. So another Alpine um, A442 or whatever it is. Nice. Oh, the Peugeot. Oh, that new uh, A-spec car as well, the, the Peugeot. But the rest I was sort of accurate. Yeah, I was correct. Look at this. Oh yeah, these guys are quick. Another Alpine Renault. This thing might even be in the in the uh, GT World Cup at the very end, or even the um, even that uh, endurance event that I've uh, I'm yet to do. Another fellow Renault Alpine race car. Oh, this this handles really well. Oh my god! It's five laps. Okay. So I'm assuming the uh, the car that's in last is the uh, Peugeot 806 because that thing is is going to be no match for these cars. Oh no, maybe the, actually no, maybe the rally car. Maybe the, there was a 206 rally car. So maybe the rally car. I don't know. I can't really see behind me if, uh, that's, if that's correct, but we'll check at the end, see if I was correct. Yeah, this car is insane, and I can't believe you unlock it, <laughs> I can't believe we actually unlocked it. I mean, the game is some like kind of the A spec mod is some somehow like somewhat scripted that way. <laughs> In a way that you know, the fact that you unlock certain A spec cars, you know, it's you know sort of obvious. Oh, this handles like a dream. On that three, oh god. This would have been good in the Gran Turismo All Stars. Of this of this mod, instead of uh, all uh, LM cars, but oh, God, this looks sick. This car. Never heard of this. Car before, but very cool. Uh, okay. Whee. Eating up these laps. It's actually really quick as well. Okay guys, final lap. Final lap of the French Nationals. So far it's been decent. A lot of fast corners. This is like the perfect race for like an endurance. Endurance race. Um with these with these kind of cars. He's just constantly flying around, lap, lap after lap. Alright. A few 
bonus to go. And it's still, still on my tail, but I've kept him at bay for five laps, so. Oh, that corner, man. Every time. Cool. Yay. There we go. And that was the French Nationals. Finn, as they say in France. <laughs> um, Peugeot Oxia, yeah. Oh, so it's an Oxia, not an Exia. Okay. Uh, and it was the 806, which I assumed was going to be dreadfully slow. But the rally car was only seven seconds down the road. So that did help quite well. Um, I'm going to wait to see what time, like how, how far back the 806 is. But it seems like it's going to be 30 seconds? 30, 33, yeah. Pretty close. Pretty close to my prediction, but very nice, very nice. Alright, that was five laps done. I expected a lot more money from that, but 15,000, good. And we got a new car. Alright, that's both races of the French Nationals complete. Now, bearing in mind we got a, a really insane car for the first race. Um, like, what are we going to get now? Uh, let's... Oh my god, no fucking way. This mod, is in... this mod is incredible. This mod is incredible, look at this. This thing. Now, I've, I've, I've used this on GT4, and it's an actual, absolute beast. Um, I used this in one of the Le Mans endurance races. Not the 24-hour one, but probably like six, I think it was like six hours or something. It was a long one. But this this thing is insane. Um, and I'm so glad it's in this mod. Um, this um, I'm I'm never gonna sell. Uh, but this is this is uh, yeah this is really good. <laughs> this is a really good prize car. Um, so that's something to use later on, I think. Um, for the GT World Cup or the, the the race at the end of the GT League, we've got a lot of options. We've got we've got quite a few options here, um, but this is definitely a contender. Anyway, um, but yeah, that was the French Nationals. I've, a, su a surprise to be sure, but uh, definitely a welcome one in terms of uh, in terms of prize cars. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, um, leave a like if you enjoyed. And uh, subscribe if you're new, um, or if you know if you, if you want to subscribe. If not, then it's okay. Just watching is uh, good enough. Um, but yeah, uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. So, peace.